Hello, my name is David Cusimano with Cusimano.com Corporation. Welcome to the basic installation tutorial for Associate Engine, also known as AE. Let's start by going to www.c3scripts.com slash Amazon. Let's scroll down, go to the download directory, select the .zip file, save that locally, open the folder, and there's the .zip file that we just downloaded. Let's unzip it. There's the folder that we just unzipped. Let's go over to our FTP program, log into our sample website. On the right hand side here, we're looking at the contents of our sample website. Your server will appear differently. What we want to do is we want to select a CGI bin directory to upload the files into. On your server, the directory may be called CGI-bin or CGI-local or something with the word CGI in its name. If you're not sure what your CGI bin directory is called, ask your hosting company. Let's select the CGI bin directory. On the local side, let's go into the directory that we unzipped. Let's select all of the files and upload them. Now that all the files have been uploaded, let's refresh the server side. Let's select the AE.pl file. Let's right click on that. And what we want to do is we want to run the change mod command. Let's select execute permissions for owner, group, and public or other. Your FTP program may refer to it as change mod 755. On the local side, let's just back up one directory. Let's select the AE.key file. After you purchase an Associate Engine license or request a temporary key, we'll send an email to you with your AE.key file. Save that file to your computer, and once you've done that, you want to upload it to the same directory on the server where AE.pl is located. So let's upload that now. Let's refresh the server side. Now let's go over to the web browser and let's type in the domain name. At this point you would type in your own domain name. Here we'll type in the sample website domain name, biggeneralstore.com. At the end of the domain name, type in slash cgi-bin slash ae.pl. At this point, we're looking at live output from Associate Engine. If you move your mouse over the first product and then look at the status bar at the bottom of the web browser, you should see your Amazon.com Associate ID in the link. This completes the installation of Associate Engine.